Hi, my name's Atlanta and welcome to this week's episode of Atlanta Delivers. Today you join me for an evening video, which I don't do much of on my channel. Um, I haven't done one in a long time, definitely not even this year, um, I'm pretty sure. So today is Thursday evening, it's 10 to 6 in the evening, um, just dropped my daughter to her dad's house. So basically what I like to do now is obviously deliver we've got just eat uber eats delivery go for be livery um but where i am i'm currently in bogner and i live over in worthing way so what i want to do is basically get deliveries from bogner to worthing and basically make our way back so that like you're paid to go go back type thing so i basically want to take deliveries that bring me back if that makes sense if you enjoy the video please make sure to hit that like button and subscribe all links are down below if you want to become a member you can view my videos 24 hours early and it supports me as well i upload every sunday at 10 a.m and every wednesday at 6 p.m appreciate all your support facebook delivery groups down below instagrams atlanta delivers let's get ourselves online and let's go okay so i'm currently nowhere near i'm over here in bognar and my shifts in worthing so i'm nowhere near my just eat shift um but delivery oh don't want to take a survey let's change i've been delivering while she was at school today change to bognar moderate go online on delivery and uber go online okay we're online on uber don't think we're really gonna have anything else at the minute I think there are two really so I'm gonna start heading back the way of Worthing and we should get something on the way for sure orders are coming through already okay we've got eight pound and eight p 8.6 miles for Tesco Barnum which is on uber I might actually do that because it's kind of the right way back even though it's far double McDonald's on delivery of 735 but it's gonna be slow so I'm gonna head towards that Tesco even though we are far away um, I know that and I know it's not the best pay, but it's the right way back. So it's 18 minutes, 6.1 miles to get to Tesco. Uh, Tesco was short out. Oh, delivery, hold on. Let's have a look if anything better comes through quickly. Morrison's £4.87. Okay, we're gonna do that instead. Um, let me get rid of that Uber. So to Morrison's, which is in the town, yeah, Morrison's, um, in Bogner town, and it's not going far from there. It's eight minutes, 2.6 miles. Nine four six nine. Nine four six nine. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And we have the order at six o'clock on the dot. Apologies, there was not full driving footage there because my camera fell down. Um, to the customer, it's not far, it's going to some flats and we are two minutes, point three of a mile away. I need a two digit code and to ID them. Okay, we're right by that, 4.94 on delivery, accept that. Okay, 6.04, we're off to the next order. It's at the train station, it's like a food van, I believe. I rejected it last week because I was like, the address was station and I was like, oh, what's that? I can't go to the train station. But then drove past it and saw it's actually just like, just off of it and it's a food trailer, I'm pretty sure. So we're heading there, we're one minute away, 0.2 of a mile. And then, yeah, that works perfectly. And then off to the customer, which also isn't too far. It's a Greek authentic, okay, I'm gonna mess up the word, Greek authentic Slovaki. Apologies, I probably pronounced that wrong. Apla Slovaki, no. Apla Sulvaki, Apla Suvaki, Apla Suvaki. <laughs> oh, 
Hi, I got 3037. Okay, thank you. Perfect, thank you. Have a good yeah. evening. Oh, another order. One stop, Middleton on sea, 4.34. Perfect. That is, again, going the right way to Little Hampton. This is perfect. It is five minutes, 1.9 miles to get to one stop. It's like it knows. Like, this is literally bringing me back the exact way like i was thinking from here because it's kind of villages for example where we're going kind of from here to arundel like back to where i want to go i was thinking oh we're probably just gonna have to drive back to arundel now no it's gonna give me a nice little village order which i wasn't really expecting but i'm happy about that <laughs> It's literally for some cigarettes and that's it. Yeah, yeah. I got delivery 8751. Yeah. There you go. Perfect, thank, thank you. you very much. No worries. Amazing! 621, we're off to the customer. They're only two minutes point six of a mile away and they've also tipped a pound which is very kind so so far this is going well oh i'm so happy Yeah, Hello. got the two digit code. 48. 48. Thank you, thank you for the tip also. Have a good evening. Thank Thanks. All done. Okay, and we're all dropped off at 6.24. I have just set my maps to Little Hampton um, because there's not much traffic. I'm kind of in between now, as I was before, but luckily I got that order. Um, I'm only 11 minutes, five miles now from Little Hampton, which is pretty good with no traffic. It's not far at all. So I'm just gonna head that way and then we'll do some orders over in Little Hampton, unless we might get something beforehand. I'm just getting back over to Little Hampton. On delivery, it offered me a Little Hampton order going all the way back to Yapton, which is like kind of where we just did that one stop. Not exactly there, but that direction and about that distance. I don't really want to be going back over that way because I don't need to go that way now. So I'm just getting into Little Hampton um, and then I'll wait for an order that's a bit better suited. I'm happy to just stay over in like Little Hampton, Rustington, that kind of area now. I'm just seeing if it will match me to an order I've accepted on Uber. Four pound and four p, 
one miles yeah it's given me it it's for tesco rustington which is a tesco bush order i'm six minutes 2.2 miles away which means did i say 3.1 miles total so when i get it it'll be like 0.9 of a mile which is perfect it's generally ready the tesco orders so that works as well happy days Yeah, it's alright, no worries. 8849? Yeah, perfect, thank you. Okay, we have the order 644. It was just a couple of minutes. He was just finishing the order when I arrived. Uh, I'm now off to the customer who is, let me just check, three minutes 0.8 of a mile away. I don't need to ID them, I just have to take a photo of dropping the order. Also, if you're a driver, it stays between us, don't worry. Do you, um, on a Tesco Bush order, you have to, if you're IDing them, you have to also get a signature. Do you get a signature from every customer? Because I get a signature from every customer. And then there was a video to do with me getting a signature. Um, and loads of people were like, oh, I've never had that before. So does that mean a lot of the drivers don't get signatures because I do it on every order? <laughs> thanks complete get the apps back online 1.6 miles four pound ten on u rates for waitrose rustington i'm three minutes 0.8 of a mile away so five items some salmon some eggs two steaks and some tuna let's go Can I just take that one? Is that right? Sorry, we have to. That's all right, no worries. So, Kieran. Yeah. Oh, amazing, thank you. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that, yes, we have to. No, that's fine. Okay. I was just if you're busy. <laughs> that's it, thank you. I thought I'd just see if I can grab it since they were busy. He was like over the other side, but they have to get it, which is fair enough. Order collected 6.54 and we are off to the customer. They're nice and nearby. I have to take a photo when I drop the order, no IDing. Uh, they are three minutes, 0.8 of a mile away. Not, oh, there it is. This is the gate here. Hmm, that's hidden. another order yet uh, but I'm gonna head to where the oh the Burger King and Subway is uh, I hope we'll get an order by then I'm only a few minutes away or if not we'll wait there for our next order change of plan I'm in Rustington so I'm just gonna go park up in Rustington we'll have around us KFC is probably most likely to get an order uh, you've got the Tesco that's kind of it really but I'm gonna wait there old lady just pulled out of me and just stared at me parked up and waiting at 7.03 this isn't normal why am i parked up in the evening i should be back to back deliveries but it's fine 1.8 miles four pound and five p i'm oh i'm already here it's for iceland i literally just need to i'm gonna drive that way because it's a one way i'm just doing a battle on pokemon go i'm a bit obsessed at the minute um it's actually a bit of a joke blaming my partner uh we're gonna just drive around to iceland which i didn't even realize is literally right here um oh just eats trying to give us an order though let's see if that's any better 
uh, Iceland. Oh, <laughs> the exact same place, but we can't do multi apping. It's not allowed. I'm just going to do the Uber uh, because it gives us more points for the Uber Pro, which I want to try and get to the next level. Uh, the order is for 12 items. I'm just going to reject that just eat and then go offline and then drive around to Iceland. Hi, am I okay to grab the Uber? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, thank you. Turn left on Woodlands Avenue, then turn left on the car. street. He's like, yeah, yeah. He's driving down the wrong one, one way and knows he's driving the wrong way because he can't bother it. Oh dear. Um, we have the order. It's 7.12 and now to the customer we have just 4 minutes 1.5 miles just ahead, uh, and I need to get a four digit pin from the customer to confirm the order. It's now in place, this is coming a couple of weeks after, but the Just Eat codes are now in place that I'm getting from customers. Um, in case you didn't see the message if you are a driver, the customer can't find the code on Just Eat, it's the last four digits of the phone number. Um, it's also the same I believe on Uber because, well, that's what mine is personally uh, and I think it's that for everyone but Justy actually put out a message saying in case the customer doesn't know, it's the last four digits of their phone number. After 4.1 miles, £5.2 for Tesco Rustington. Number. Yeah, it's easier, like, it's Perfect, thank you. There we go, no worries, have a good evening. Thanks. 7.17 and that is all complete. And now we're going to the Tesco Rustington. I think the drop off on this one brings me slightly out of Littlehampton, which is good because then I can probably start making my way back over to where I live, start heading that way. Uh, I'm five minutes, 1.5 miles from Tesco. Okay, no worries, this one. Probably that one he's doing, there's none out there. Yeah, no worries. It has to be, it says it's the bar that's been Yeah, no worries. It's gonna be... Oh, it's a lot of bags. Yeah. How many items left? Uh, only three. Oh, okay, uh, no worries. It's just not all No worries. Eight, two, five, nine? Yeah. Would you be upset if I said no? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's fine, I've only got this. Thank you. And we are off to the customer at 7.28. It was a few minutes whilst he finished getting it ready. It's three bags, so it was quite a few items. And now I was correct, it is going towards the way of home which is good. Uh, to the customer is seven minutes, 2.5 miles. It's going to Angmering, which is a village outside where I am now. Uh, I need to ID the customer and I'll also need a signature.
that's all right, you're fine. Just need a signature as well, one second. Perfect. There we go. No worries, have a good evening. Thank you, bye. is all complete at 7.37. I've just set my maps back towards home. I'm not finishing yet, but I just want to head in that direction. Oh, order. It is on delivery £4.54 uh, for Sainsbury's Rustington, which I am driving the wrong way. Yes, I'm driving the wrong way. Hold on, let me turn around. I am six minutes, 1.7 miles away, and then it's coming back to Angmaring. So it's going to be around three miles total. It's basically coming back to where I am now. Um, they're normally pretty good at this Sainsbury's. And I'd say 90% of the time they're ready, which is good. It's a big order, 21 items. We got a uh, Vaseline cling film, diet coat, diet coat, diet coat, cottage cheese, uh, lemon dressing, salsa, lettuce, celery, sugar, avocados, hummus, ham, bananas, orange juice, jelly baby sweets, bread, bread, and eggs. the customer at 7.47. Look at how breath I'm carrying all of that. Um, five minutes, 1.6 miles to get to the customer. The customer has also kindly tipped a pound on top as well, which is very much appreciated. I have noticed recently, I've been doing more delivery than usual and also delivering more than usual uh, because now <laughs> delivering is my income and yeah, I need to pay, pay bills. So I've been delivering a lot more. I'm doing quite a bit more on delivery than usual. And I have noticed by doing more on delivery, I am getting more tips. Thank you. Did I deliver to you today already or yesterday? Uh, <laughs> and every, day, every day blurs into one. Yeah. Have you got the code? 63. Thank you. I'll be quiet. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, we've got those ones. And that one. Thanks for the tip also. Have a good evening. Thank you. Bye. Okay, so it's been just a tiny bit over two hours. Hopefully you can see me. Um, I don't normally film at night. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. In total, we did £37.90 in two hours. So I'm pretty happy with that. And I'm heading back to the way where I live, which was the goal as well. Miles, we did 30 miles. So 30 miles, £37.90, uh, which I'm pretty happy with as long as it's at least a pound a mile. Nowadays, I like it to be more than that. But I was also trying to get back, as you know. Um, so, yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm going to carry on delivering for a little bit longer, not do too late of a night, um, and then have a full-on weekend delivering. Uh, as I said, hit that subscribe button, and I'll now see you Wednesday at 6pm. See you soon. Bye!